This is so weird on so many levels. Also kinda. That didn't quite go according to plan, but at least I'm alive. I need to get really? back to the clock tower and clear my head. Oh really? Wow. Well, if you think about it, such a safe is probably the most safe place in a collapsing building. <laughs> a friend in need. Yeah, I wasn't a ghost. Okay, continue. Jeez. Wow, 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 wow. Well, what was that, huh? What did that just say? Open the journal. Focus abilities? I have eight focus upgrades. Ooh, okay, sense. So, these kind of things are only shown when I am on focus. Ability to stun an opponent with a single blow. With focus vision activated, target the opportunist's opponent's torso and press R. Ooh, nice. By slowing the world around you? Wow. <sighs> Ability to move more silently while using focus reduces the range of the sounds you generate, including those produced on noisy surfaces. Hmm. I don't know. I don't want to have marksmen. I don't really kill. No. Able to know where unique loot, loots, and collection items are hidden. Handprints appear to reveal the path. Well, let's have one of those, please. Ooh! It cost me seven. No, wait, it didn't. It cost me one. Okay, I know, I know. This is the first time I look at this. I didn't know that I had any. Mm. Okay, I like the speed one. What? It said seven available. It still does. So when I find those shards, I, I get upgrades. Okay. Let's have a look. There's nothing here, but okay. More coils. It's kinda nice. Okay. Ain't those focus abilities really seem to be something. But why in the world do we have so many lights on? Oh, whatever. I guess we're well covered. Okay, let's keep going. Damn. What's a nice kind of, I guess, well, well, side. Look at that, wow. Are these civilians going to be enemies from now on? Would be wicked. Would be sick. Would be understandable. Death to the Baron's dogs! The revolution has begun! Our time has come for the city to face the dawn! Okay. So long, Black Tops! Seems the Graven mob has had enough and is out to kill anyone who isn't one of them. That includes me. Best to avoid any confrontation. Mm, yeah, I knew it. Why would they care if I'm up here? Oh, don't question the game, Shen. Don't question the game. So many already. Ah. Uh. Okay. Nah. 
Let's see what's in here. Oh, he's got a bandage on his hand. You see that? It's nice. Every night it's the same. He stumbles home drunk. He takes whatever he can. So there's really nothing in here. He's off to pay his gambling debts. Oh, Libby. Libby, where's Literally the nothing. Ring? <laughs> you... And we already got the wedding ring. The wedding ring was near the chimney. The iron tyrant, a taste of his own progress. Right here. Don't have two coins left together. Oh, no, you're not supposed to jump, you're supposed to get down. Oh. Oh, nice. We'll give the watch a taste of their own law tonight. Oh. Someone is in the shadow. Garrett, can you please move your butt? I see me all the way away compared to what they usually, usually sit in their corners. We have 600 again, that's pretty good. You read the newspaper? They're saying the livestock home worked. Worked for killing all the animals, I suppose. The gloom's still here. I can smell shit all the way from the Ooh. Look at that. I want that. Thank you very much. Now, what do we have here? Ooh. What it didn't seem to do anything. See. Let's see what my is seeing. Nothing. I upgraded them and... And you statues? Do you have any business? So what are you doing out here? Waiting for a storm that'll wash all this away. See nothing. Ah, <sighs> I hate those boxes that you push through. And stuff. I really don't like that mechanic. I know it makes sense, but I really don't like it. What happened to our reinforcements? I am your reinforcements. There's no one left. What do we do? We can't wait if they catch us out here. These bastards are going to cars. They Well, fuck. <laughs> There's times where I love levels that you can just go switch between them. <laughs> oh god. Hey you. So there's parts of town where the guards are still pretty much 
draw. This, of course, parts. This gloom is everywhere. Boosh. Oh, wait. He's no ordinary guard. So hungry. Okay, big boy. We're gonna take a rest in the corner. Something's <laughs> different about you. Wait, I've got it. You don't stink of sweat and piss. <laughs> I just rolled with Polly Adler, the sweetest smelling doc frock in the skin market. Ugh. I guess her perfume's still clinging to me. Lucky bastard. I've been on her waiting list for two months. I waited five. She's worth what? I know. Weird people. Weird people. Okay, so... Nothing special in here either. Damn, I really have to go far. This is another level crossed. <clears throat> Let's talk to Bessel. But it's really far away. Crowbow. Nothing in here. Oh, a cuddly bed. Wait. Ah, uh, no. Put it away. He's not putting it away for some reason. I don't want to throw it. Put it away. Thank you. Dear God. Game mechanics pain up my gaming existence. Why are you suddenly dashing through these shadows like that? Like a shadow in the night. But um, like a shadow in the night. <laughs> and he's breathing for some reason. It appears to take stamina off of him somehow. Oh, hey, Basil. Basil. <sighs> you look almost human, Basil. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you can survive what they serve here, you can survive on anything. <sighs> How's the hand? So uh, Like your pride, I'll bet. <laughs> that shit bucket needs to get what's coming to him. I need a favor. <laughs> oh? You still have your boat? Oh, I'd get a room here if I were you. Find yourself a nice gal and bed down until this whole thing blows over. I need to do a lot of What is a carnival with no attraction, say? <sighs> oh, we still I need to get across the Mars side. Happened. Just let me know when you want to go. I'll be there. Oh. Oh, I don't want to go to the asylum. Ooh, <laughs> I don't like asylums. Full of scary stuff. I'll be a penniless joke. The worst kind. That's Basso. That's. I don't know. I have uh, something for all your yeah, nefarious Yeah, it's, it's good, it's good. So talk and show me your stuff. Okay. Quiver. Leather. Hardening. Nah. I want to have this. Sounds good. 
So, soul down, that means there's no better lock pick. I don't want to have doctor's orders, so the poppies are cheaper. So now we, we can buy one. Poppy, poppy, poppy. Oh, I need... Really? Oh, fine. For you, I'm always... <laughs> yeah, shut up. <laughs> that guy. I still have to find the stuff. How long has it been now? I don't know. Oh wait, I should talk to Bass and not get back to the town. Screw the town. I should talk to Basso. Oh, Basso. What would you call him? I would say Basso. Just piss him off. Basso. If you're looking for extra coin, I got some jobs you can help me with. Best contracts in the city. What? No. Need some tools of the trade? I'll be a penniless joke. The worst kind. What? I know a pinchcock claims she's the Baron's mistress. Tries to charge a full gold piece for her stories. <laughs> Easy pickings for the best thief in town. Just the job I would have picked. Easy pickings for the best thief in town. Um, be careful. They don't do bail around here. Okay, now let's do some jobs, I guess. For some reason, I cannot ask Basso to take me to the asylum. Which is weird. Maybe I can. Oh, yeah, thank you. Please. Screw the jobs. Just wanna keep the story going. Uh, ready to go? Yep. Now I remember why I don't like boats. Well, I hate <laughs> swimming a whole lot more, so get in. Now I'll take the oars. You row about as well as I can dance. Sure. The exercise will do you some good. <laughs> Only with one oar. Thanks to the general, there was, there was a narrow escape from the keep. My hand is evidence of that. Still, finding the primal stone pieces in a great safe was a surprise. Not, not thought about that since the accident between ghosts and, and grave, and it's getting hard to think. Oh. So, All bass on what walls. does Aaron have to do with Moira? I don't know. Ghosts. Do you believe and in ghosts? hallucinations. Huh? Spirits. You know, the dead coming back to haunt the living. Punish them. You think Aaron's haunting you? I don't know, perhaps. Perhaps, he says. He's having epic hallucinations. But why am I remember whatever? And he says a ritual. Some kind of an explosion. Aaron died. I'll never How forget you know? it. And everything else is gone. Ah, oh, come on, Garrett. I know you wouldn't have put that gal in harm's way. She'd have put herself there easy enough. Hmm. Now, there's an answer in here somewhere. I could feel it. You could feel this it. Place Are you feeling it? Oddly quiet since there was a riot here. Some patients escaped. A few boats have come in. Nothing has come out. Well, that sounds just about like Garrett. my game, my place. I don't know what you expect to find in there, but be careful. Don't become a ghost yep. yourself. Lots of crazy people. I've been a ghost all my life. Hmm. It's been a long time since okay. this island had a good reputation. Will I really find you here? Second. Which just falling on so hard can it be? It 
This looks like an, an effing graveyard. What asylum? This reeks graveyard all over the place. There we go. <laughs> We have a map. That's something at least. I see something shiny. A golden mirror. Are you kidding me? Just reminding myself what the melee button is. Fuck was that? Are we going crazy? Hello. A good ambiance at least. Hmm. Okay. Seems someone's expecting me. Oh god no. Oh, I don't wanna. I don't wanna. Anyway, I don't know. Uh, what? <laughs> I shouldn't be here. Uh, oh. Is it the asylum that's haunted with me? Is probably a good start. I don't wanna. Let's read that. <sighs> no wizard, Lord Abercrombie, something, something. No, you shouldn't be. I know I'm walking slowly, but I'm walking slowly, but... Ah! <sighs> Fuck. I knew it, it would, it would play on a scary scale. I knew it. Everyone knew. When they heard a silent, they knew. Even Batman Arkham Asylum was scary for me at times. It's just my own steps. Why am I getting so nervous? <sighs> okay, what do we have here? With the Received patient number 18, young female, admitted by the state and delivered under guard. Condition moderate to poor. Numerous abrasions and broken bones arrived drugged and unconscious, instructed to keep her that way. Due to extreme violent tendencies when not sedated, moved to women's ward, central seclusion for observation, treatment, nurse Albemarle. Okay. Why does Gareth think that she is in a fucking cell? I don't really want to keep going. Oh, 
Oh, oh, it's a shovey shovey door where you can jump scare me and stuff. Okay. Jump scare. You know, I'm happy for as long as two naked crazy guys are not going to go after me. Patient number 63 has been sneaking out of her seclusion, creating disturbances in the man's ward. The vent from the shows appears to be her point of egress and has been sealed with threaded screws. Observation will determine whether this measure was successful or not. That's all mill. That's a, that's a different patient. Apparently I need a rope arrow or something. Huxley, I notice you have been absent quite frequently of late. I know the shifts and reformations are difficult for you to bear, but we all must do our part to ensure the well-being of our most grievously ill patients. I have also noticed that, lately, you appear to be limping. Get Dr. Stepman to look you over. We need all our nurses in top shape while our patron is on the prowl. So someone's been injured. By who? A patient number 63? Broken down. <sighs> Fuck, I hate the peak. Option. Okay, let's turn this. Save and no more luck. <sighs> Why? Yamsky. I feel like I maybe should not open this. Who the fuck is moaning? Sorry if I seem quiet, I'm just trying to see who just may be here somewhere. I'm going to close the doors that I've been in before. the places to hide in. The headaches are getting worse. Some days I can barely see straight. I should be documenta documenting my symptoms, but they come and go so rapidly at times that I'm not sure I, I felt them at all. All I can discern is that they seem to grow stronger the closer I am to Dr. Hanfield's patients. 
but it shouldn't even be possible. It could just be the mental strain of blocking out all the screaming. I swear he torments them on purpose when he knows it's my shift. I guess I should add paranoia to a list of symptoms. Yeah, I'm paranoid as well. Are you hearing that? Fucking game. You wonder why I don't play horror games. I close this now. I don't want to pick lock that. We all know what happens then. Patient number 29 is showing remarkable progress following the removal of patient number 18 from the woman's ward. He has become both tractable and agreeable. One could assume he's almost his normal self, though I admit I can I'm keen to see him in the treatment center for a further study and analysis. His condition is not currently severe enough to warrant a transfer to reformation. However, if he were to re resume this previous percussive demonstrations of an anxiety, we must never forget that the <coughs> bonds of mental illness are both invisible and insipid. He may require treatment yet. Dr. Hunt failed. Okay, we're going to lockpick this now. When when I start lockpicking, the game will jump scare me. I am sure I sell of that. Okay. I keep hearing it. I mean, something even shoot me. With the game. What was hidden must be uncovered, no? Oh, <laughs> come on. Now what? Fuck it. Let us not forget, however, that the care of the mentally ill comes with a price. We must pay with our care, with our patience, with our, and with our blood. For it is our blood that these poor creatures come, and it is to us that they owe their peculiar sentiments. Take, for example, the master sneak thief. So attribute to these times of woe, he is a man so solely tempted by that which to him does not belong. A misplacement of desire to see the world in an order which it must not devour. Showering. Freaking showering. Something like running after me, being like, hey, let's go. I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh. These are the Baron's locks. What's so important to him in an asylum? 
Yeah, that's what I care about, not the freaky noises. Looks like I... The woman's ward key has been relocated to my desk in the man's ward. The dancer had been sneaking out to steal it and torment the linguist. If you need it, which you shouldn't, come and see me when I'm on duty. Need, need to, to have stand. myself committed. Voluntarily, of course. Oh. I get to go back to the male ward. With dramatic music in the background. Yeah. The double locks have been placed on the archivist's door. As various sup supplies have been going missing, how he's getting out, I don't know, but I suspect the watchman has been helping him. I've relocated the letter from M10 to M2, so two are no longer neighbors. That should quell their shenanigans for a while. If you got hold of this key, send a thief to catch a thief. Hmm. Hmm. Sorry if I go quiet. I'm just trying to hear stuff. If you get the notion. This should get me into the female ward. Oh god. You see that, right? Come on, <clears throat> come on here, man to man. No more wimpy jump scares. Where is that son of a bitch? I'm sorry if I'm quiet, I'm just expecting to stand in front of me any second right now. Oh, whatever. There he is. You son of a bitch. He doesn't even look really scary, he's just... Weird. And now he's gone, right? Yep. Perhaps there are oh, some yeah. kind of medical records that could tell me more. Oh, 
Oh god, the longer I spend in this fucking asylum, the more bonkers I go. Uh. Swear to god. Wait. It's, no, it's just a puppy. I'm seeing a human, I'm seeing something scary. So, uh, Dr. Hanfield seems to have come down with a disfiguring ailment of the back. He has trouble standing upright and performing his operation. He asked me to examine him. Oh, sorry. Uh, but I'm afraid I could find nothing wrong. Of course, he then called me a failure and stumped away, so I neglected to mention that the back of his head is now certainly bald. Or that his left leg is beginning to twist as he walks. I, might, I may suggest he tries on electrotherapy techniques. I'm sure his patients would be more than happy to apply treatment on his behalf. Uh, I'm the F on. <sighs> Read that. <sighs> Fuck you. Oh yay, I get to go downstairs where the scary weird thing is. Food here. This is so weird. rooms are just made to scare me. Just what the fuck. I'm expecting a jump scare. No? Okay. Can live with that. So weird. I know there's stuff laying around, but I really don't want to pick stuff up right now. Fucking balls. Uh. 
Oh no, don't, just don't, don't do that to me. <sighs> Fuck. Ten shades of weird. Fuck. Oh yeah, there's light on, let's run towards it. Someone, someone must be living here now. <sighs> Extraordinary creature, blah blah blah. Won't someone bring Edwina her wine? She's been waiting so long. Wine? Edwina? What? There's a fog coming tonight, a chill coming tonight, such a sea of change coming tonight. Is Garrett losing it? Oh, lovely. Our patients have been exhibiting increased aggression of late. We had a similar incident la similar incidents last year when patient number 18 was in a central seclusion, but those ceased with the removal to reformation. Still, the, all the behaviors occurring now show disturbing similarities. Patient number 82 actually growled at me when I brought her meal this morning. A child should not be able to make those noises. All we can do is continue to provide the care that they need. I will do not. I will not be responsible for sending any more patient to Huntfield's abattoir. Sometimes the light is scarier than the shadows. Uh, when we supposed to get something here? Just saying. Pains me to confirm your inquiry, but in fact, patient number 18 will undergo a procedure in room R 3F, as you fear. I thought we'd we close the door on that room of horrors of horrors years ago. The subject is classified selective experimentation on the instructions of Baron Norsquist himself. This is the last time I sign a patient over to treatment center. They need doctors, not butchers. Oh god, oh god, I don't want to go there. Hanfield will be taking over this subject in all aspects. I pity the girl, Thurlow. May she find peace somewhere in her madness. Nurse Albemarle. I told them you were in trouble, but what did you do? Show me. Show me. Really? Yeah, why not? A puppy. And a note that I'm gonna read. And yet Moira Asylum is not without its share of troubles. Battered by the constant to and fro of coastal winds and its melancholy and beleaguered atmosphere not common to the more ground buildings of the city, nor does it want for draughts and other embell embellishments her staff are both courteous and cheerful despite their conditions for which they are not to be commented, commended. More startling yet, however, is the fertile soil of the Salem's Island within which have been sown the many seeds of wildflowers no longer common to the more civilized surrounds to which we have become accustomed. Okay. Oh yeah. My favorite. Decent, yeah. 
I wanna uh, not ready to read that. Confidentiality agreement, blah blah blah. Let's just get it over with. Ugh. Fuck. Why? Endgame? <laughs> Why not? What's with the threatening music, really? Let's not jump down there. Oh yeah, just what I wanted. Butcha, butcha, butcha. Take a look, all huh? Dead. All dead but the shadows. They were taken by the shadows. The shadows have been up. It's the people now do I have to be careful? need power. There's probably a generator down here somewhere. Find and start the power generator. Yeah. There we go. Start. I was expecting a big bad jump scare. You know what? I've had enough for now. I really do. Let's save the game. Okay. <laughs> oh god. The expectation is what's crushing me, not the game itself. Okay. Um. So, thank you all so much for watching. Please leave a like and maybe subscribe. I'll leave comments in the section below, I'll read them, I'll um, answer and stuff. Tell me if I've missed something important that you think that I should do. Should I do any missions, you tell me. Anyway, see you next time. Bye bye!